everyone. Happy Home Brew Wednesday. Doug coming here out here at the farm again. It's awfully windy tonight. I hope you can hear me. Not drinking a home brew today, uh, but I do got me a hot date ale. Uh, Piney River Brewing from uh, Buccaneers, Missouri. I'm not exactly sure where that's at, but it's down there by where we go fishing at. Cheers, everyone. Amber ale brewed with a touch of sweet dates and a hint of chipotle pepper heat. A little bit of heat. I like a little bit more heat, but that's okay. Still pretty good. Max, get over here. So, we are out here today. I am going to uh, tinker with my trellis system, see if I can get an idea of uh, what I can do. Last time the uh, brew dog and the deer incident just totally nixed my idea. So I'm out here tinkering with that. Um, also I got in the mail a little package. Got me some hops. I got four of them here. Two of them are Sunbeam Golden, and I got two Pride of Ringwood. It's gonna be interesting to see how these guys turn out. Uh, I'm gonna kind of plant them out here in some buckets in the ground a little bit uh, because I'm not sure exactly where I'm gonna plant everything yet. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. See how things go. Uh, hopefully, uh, they gotta be better in the buckets than they do in the ground. Hopefully it'll start sprouting some hops and kind of go from there. So what's been going on this week? Uh, I got my IPA caked up. The uh, pale ale moved over into secondary. Um, this is all on Friday. And Friday, I brewed my SJ4 beer. One of them. So uh, let's take a little, uh, view a little footage of that. It is time. It is time to brew your best beer. Got a little Craig tube going on. And I got a mess. An empty beer. Got some water filling up. And I'm gonna have an SJ4 beer here pretty soon. Oh, don't stand on the hose, Doug. I don't know if you can see that with the whirlpool going on in there. <clears throat> Hope you guys like them tall, dark, and handsome because that's what you're gonna get. Cheers. We got the SJ Poor beers. They appear to be bubbling away. This has got the German ale right there in it. And the British ale yeast to that guy. Yeah, I really wish I would have messed up and put that star sand in. Or at least dumped that star sand out. Waste about two gallons. Otherwise, it would have been a good brew day. Cheers. So as you can see, it's a little bit, uh, I don't know. I messed up with, with some of my uh, volumes there because I forgot to dump out some star sand. So I dumped out about two gallons worth of wort. I still got plenty of uh, wort left, so um, hopefully that guy turns out well and I'll be uh, proud of it when I ship it off. Um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to this. So uh, what else has been going on? As you guys can see, I put a new uh, a trailer uh, about me video. Um, Appreciate all the comments I've gotten on that so far. That was out on Monday. So, uh, yeah. Things are going good. Um, I do uh, have one feature I want to feature this week. Uh, and that would be uh, Sully Beer Kits. Go ahead and check him out. The other night I was brewing my beer and uh, I probably talked to him probably for two, three hours on Uvu. So, uh, 
Yeah, definitely check him out. Yeah. Check this it, place. It's just about done. I'm going to take this off and put that on there. You got Sully Beer Kits yeah. here, man. Chatting away. Oh, hey. He's got his iPad. He's taking a video of me while I'm taking a video of him. How awesome is that? That's right. <laughs> Cheers, everyone. So what's on tap? Really nothing right now. Uh, just got to get this hop stuff done. Uh, it's been taking me a lot longer than I thought, but who knows? We'll see. So that's all I got for this week, guys. Cheers. Happy Homebrew Wednesday. Have a great week, rest of the week, and a fantastic weekend.